friends how are you we were doing chapter 3 pair of linear equation in two variable so today we will solve words problem how will you solve words problem and then first you will make the equation and then solve these two equation by elimination method there will be no problem so one question i am taking second question first part of exercise 3.4 if we add 1 to the numerator and subtract 1 from the denominator the fraction reduces to 1 it becomes 1 by 2 If we only add one to the denominator, what is the fraction? So, my dear students, first you suppose let the fraction be that is x upon y. So, fraction, you know, numerator upon denominator. You know very well, fraction is equal to numerator upon denominator. You keep in mind. So now, what is saying? Case first, you see. If we add one to the numerator, this is a fraction. If we add one to the numerator and subtract one from the denominator, it this fraction becomes one. It reduces to one. So now cross multiply x plus one one x plus one. Y minus one one zero. Y minus one. X plus one minus y. So x minus y minus one minus one plus one that side minus one. So this is minus. So this is the first equation. Now second equation. You see the second case. What is saying? It becomes one by two. This fraction becomes one by two when if we only add one to the denominator. So if I add one to the denominator, it becomes one by two. Now cross multiply two x is equal to y. Two x is equal to y plus one. A shift y here. So this is two x minus y is equal to one. So this is the Second equation. This is first equation. So these are two equation. So my dear students, so these are two equation. We have to solve these two equation for x and y. So first equation is x minus y minus two. This is first equation. Second equation, two x minus y is equal to one. This is second equation. Now. We have to solve these two equation by elimination method. You know, elimination method is by equating the coefficient of either x or y. So you see here different, but if you see the coefficient of y, they are same. Now I think very much easy. You see the coefficient of y, they are equal. Now directly you subtract. So by subtracting, you cancel this. Minus one plus one cancel it is minus x. This is minus two minus one minus three. So divide by minus one. So x is equal to three. X is equal to three. Put in equation here in first. So what will get here? Three minus y is equal to minus two minus y minus two. So minus y minus five, so cancels y is equal to five. So x three y five is not the answer, but answer is we have to write in proper form fraction is x by y. So answer is three by five is the answer. So my dear friends, after reading words problem. First, you make the two equation carefully. If two equations are correct, then you have to solve by elimination method by equating the coefficient of either x or y. So we are getting x three y five here fraction x upon y three by five is the correct answer. Clear this? 
Now, one more question we will take from this exercise 3.4. That is, second question, fifth part. What is the statement? One minute you read. A lending library has a fixed charges for first three days and an additional charge for each day thereafter. Clear this. And Sarita paid rupees 27 for a book kept for seven days. While Sasi paid rupees 21 for the book she kept for five days. Find the fixed charges and the charges for each extra days. Clear? So, as you go in library in your school, if rent is there, then he is saying for first three days fixed charges are there. And then if you keep more days, then per day charges will be extra. So, three days extra, three days fixed charges are there. So, you can score in the starting let fixed charges fixed charges for first three days that is rupees x so let next is let charges for each extra day let charges for each extra day means First three days x rupees fixed and then after three days per day rupees y charges will be applied. So my dear students what is saying you see according to question what is saying one has paid Sarita has paid 27 rupees for seven days for seven days for seven days she has paid that is 27 rupees so my dear students for first three days for first three days x rupees fix how many days left four days left then per day y rupees so for three days x and then how many days left four days left so four per day y rupees so then x plus four y is equal to 27. This is the first equation and second equation also. While Sasi paid 21 for 5 days. So very simple. 5 days 21 rupees. So my dear students, if for 3 days x rupees and how many days left? 2 days y rupees. Per day, clear this y rupees. So for first three days x rupees fixed. Now two days left per day y rupees. Then total she will pay x plus 2y is equal to 21 rupees. This is the second equation. Clear this. So very simple. This is for three days and plus two days, two, three plus two, five days, 21 rupees. This is for three days, for seven rupees, seven day charges, 27. Very simple. So now these are two equation x plus 4y is equal to 27 first equation x plus 2y is equal to 21 second equation now what you will do you solve by elimination method you see 1x 1x option is same then subtract so cancel so 2y 27 minus 21 26 one six is here 6 by 2 so y is equal to d. So what do you say? Put value of y either in first equation or in second equation. So if I will take put y is equal to 3 in equation first. So x plus 4 y. 4 3 is 12. 27 4 3 are 12 so this is 27 so x is equal to shift this so 27 minus 12 x is equal to 15 so value of x or y you got but write the answer in proper form so therefore 
fixed charges for three days. First three days, that is rupees x. That is rupees fifty. The charges per day extra. Per day extra value y. That is rupees c. Near this. So my dear students, in this way. Very simple. Fixed charges sums. So many types are there in your book. So you have to revise this word, words problem, these concepts. Fixed charges and then charges per day extra. So you have to revise this. Three point four. Complete with every question, with every part. There will be no problem if you revise seriously. Thank you. Very good.